Home Depot, same store sales coming in lower than projected in its um, most recent quarterly earnings report. The first time Home Depot failed to beat sales estimates in nearly two years. So could the home improvement giants miss hint at a cooling housing market? Joining us now, Rogers Healy, Rogers Healy and Associates, real estate Hi. owner. Rogers, good to see you. What's your take on this? Good to see you. We're fine. <laughs> I, I think that <laughs> there's a Give lot of factors that go into it. We're fine, please. Uh, we're, please continue. We're, we're, yeah, we're fine. So I, I, I've got multiple theories on this. I think the first thing is we had a very cold and wet spring. You can't go build when you can't go build on dry land. Number two, real estate prices have continued to increase, right? So a lot of people that were leaning towards purchasing something new probably have leaned now towards renovating the current property. Third theory. Home Depot is known for doing a lot of multifamily, people purchasing from Home Depot to do a lot of multifamily builds. The price of land that's zoned multifamily has also increased so much that people are starting to slow down. So it, it's a lot of factors, but you know, I, I think that we're completely secure. And the good news is their earnings were only down a couple points. It wasn't anything disastrous. And maybe people went shopping at Lowe's the last quarter. But <laughs> um, yeah, it, it, it just was, it, it could have been weather related, it could have been a fluke, and it also could have been people realizing they can't afford that next level. So it's like that show, love it or list it, they might have just gone and find a, found a way to love it again, put some money into it, and <laughs> save some money on the back end. Hey Rogers, it's Mike Murphy, and I, I totally agree hey, with buddy. you um, regarding Home Depot, we're fine. Um, but I think a, yeah. a lot of what's going on right now with the housing market, even if the housing market were to slow down a little bit, uh, which I don't think is the case, but if it was, I think historically yeah. you've seen that in, in that type of marketplace, people will go out and try to renovate their current homes. So that could even right. play in a, as a strong card for Home Depot, correct? Yeah, I agree. And I think that, you know, they probably want everybody using them instead of just a select group. So, yeah, it, again, like we're, we're completely protected. The only thing that's going to affect this in certain price points are the rising interest rates. And I think that we're going to see, you know, maybe a little bit of volatility in the next quarter if, if they raise even just a, a quarter of a point. But again, Home, Home Depot is one of the two 800 pound gorillas. And I don't think anybody's afraid that they're going anywhere. Rogers, great to see you. Thank you so much, sir. You too.